This what happens when y'all let non-black people into black culture. See? See? They turn into some damn informants or something. They only be hanging with y'all so they can come in and hear what we talking about and so they can send them to them peoples and shit. You see what I'm saying? Y'all let them of us come into every culture and invade it. And y'all don't own black music no way. You see what I'm saying? Y'all don't own that shit no way. You see what I'm saying? Then they implant people like Takashi 6 9 You see what Takashi 6 9 They, you know, put him, you know, at the forefront of the music. At the forefront of the music. You see what I'm saying? Black music. And you know what I'm saying? And y'all sit up there, you know, wondering why he's sitting on the stand and, you know, blurting out all Cardi B, this, that, and the third, Jim Jones, blurting out everybody's name. What do they got to do with your situation? You see what I'm saying? And they don't, like they said they got recordings of, you know what I'm saying? Him talking to them. Or whatever about whatever, whatever. See, that ain't my concern. What I'm saying is, why y'all let non-black people in the uh, black culture? You see what I'm saying? Y'all, and then, see, even though y'all don't own it, y'all can at least, you know, when one of them, they put one of them in, banish the motherfuckers. You see what I'm saying? That's what y'all get. Y'all puts them right there, you know, and then, See, there's, you know, one of the brothers. See, they used to be, you know, where the brothers, you know what I'm saying, can make their way through and, you know, maybe get their music heard and make a better way for their family. You see what I'm saying? But y'all don't let everybody invade it and corrupt it and corrupt it. Now everybody's savage. Savage. That's the worst word on the planet. Y'all, you know, given the historical word savage, validation and then whine about what they pop you down in the street and then y'all rapping about it wearing the t-shirts wearing the hats doing all of that how can you you know whine about when they do that to you and you know uh and you per perpetuate the culture you see what i'm saying but i guarantee you you know the next grammy gonna be given to somebody non-black in hip-hop the same thing with reggae. The Grammy gonna be given to a non-black in hip hop. All the categories in those areas gonna be given to non-blacks, and then the blacks gonna be sitting out on the outskirts. You see what I'm saying? Y'all gonna be sit. We gonna be sitting out on the outskirts on some shit we created, just like jazz, just like uh, uh any other uh musical. Cause we created music. We created music. You see what I'm saying? How y'all like our music but don't like black people? You see what I'm saying? And then you got this man sitting on a stand snitching on, you know, people, certain people, you know, are legends. You know what I'm saying? Jim Chong, Dipset, they legends. You know what I'm saying? You know, just because you done got in trouble, don't be bringing that bad name up. That ain't got nothing to do with him. You know what I'm saying? Because I got, that ain't my point. What I'm saying, this is what happened. Just like the rosters, you know, don't control their own music. Now you got all these uh, Europeans saying that they roster. You not roster. What do we share in common? You can get a haircut and join the establishment. We can't never do that. We black forever. We black forever. We can never be a part of what y'all are part of. So how can you come into our culture Get some dreads, blaze up, and listen to a little Bob Marley and say you a roster. It's way much deeper than that, player. It's way much deeper than that. You see what I'm saying? It's way much deeper than that. Black people come before uh, the Bible. You see what I'm saying? We come before the Bible. You know what I'm saying? They try to demonize black people in the Bible. And that was a way for them to accept that slavery culture slave obey your master and then you look at the picture of the the the, the guy it looked just like them so it's the same thing with the music you see what i'm saying eminem uh what's some more of them uh culture vultures uh uh that that don't mean they can't rap what i'm saying is 
you in a culture that's not of your own. We can't even participate in y'all culture, not even a little bit. Not even they put they sprinkle us in just to get an illusion that we participate. But in reality, we can't even participate in y'all culture at all. At all. We can't even participate in y'all culture at all. Nobody never said we was Americans. Nobody never said we was citizens. I want somebody to show me where they said black people were citizens. We can't even really, we are unwanted culture. You know what I'm saying? In this land. You know what I'm saying? We are unwanted people in this land. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, we created music. And, you know, it's been t invaded too. Just like they invaded our lands, music been invaded too. So I bet you. Just like them, the fake rosters, people that's talking about they rosters, you can never be roster. I don't know. See, it when it when it jump off, y'all gonna see the blacks want to bring everybody in. Just like them niggas be saying the brown and the black, the brown and the black. We ain't got time to be concerned with everybody else. Uh, political issues, they moral issues, they humanity issues. We don't got, as black people, we don't got time to be concerned with that. You see what I'm saying? The only thing we need to be concerned about is with ourselves, because that's exactly what they taught from birth to know that. Hold down